Hey guys, welcome to the first episode of a series on video game biology. Our first topic is on bioluminescence. Bioluminescence occurs when an organism produces a high energy pigment that emits light after a series of chemical reactions. While it is not often thought about, it's been used to create impressive visuals in games such as Terraria, Zelda, Bioshock, Spyro, and many others. This image is taken from Skyrim and is inspired by bioluminescent fungi, a unique form of bioluminescence of which there is more than 75 species all around the world. Of the different kinds, fungal bioluminescence is particularly fascinating as scientists struggle to understand its purpose. Some suggest it may assist in spore dispersal, prevent consumption, or simply be a result of other biochemical functions. What's your favorite kind, Aaron? Hi guys! Thanks, Kevin. Well, my favorite, which is also one of the more prominent forms of bioluminescence, is the kind exhibited by glowworms. Glowworms are a common name for a variety of insects, including click beetles, fungus gnats, and fireflies. There are around 3,600 different kinds of glowworms all around the world. Some, like the New Zealand glowworm, or Arachnocampa luminosa, a type of fungus gnat, use bioluminescence to attract prey into their silken threads. The larva of the New Zealand glowworm, for example, glows brighter when hungry, making the cave ceiling look like the night sky. Others, like the firefly, or Fontanus pyrolus, use light signals for mating. The males and females flash back and forth until they find each other, similar to a game of Marco Polo. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks, Aaron. As you can see, there's a surprising variety of organisms that exhibit bioluminescence and have contributed to the creative process of game design. In our next episode, we will discuss abyssal gigantism. Till next time!